So hey guys, today I have a really short and really interesting demonstration for you. So I think you may have heard of LC tank circuit in which the charges, the current is resonated between the inductor and the capacitor. Now what we are going to see is on the oscilloscope we are going to see how does this look like. Like I just took a reading just, a sec just some seconds before and you can see how the damped oscillations look like on the oscilloscope uh, once we strike the R LC circuit, R LC circuit, sorry, not R LC, it's the LC circuit. So I'm just ringing the bell or just uh, powering the circuit with this power supply set to 10 volts. Okay, so I'm just gonna set up my oscilloscope. Okay, I'm just gonna set the trigger of my oscilloscope. So that it will trigger correctly okay we are all set now we'll just ring the bell i'm just using this two alligator clips that are coming from the power supply to power the circuit we just need to touch the this um, wire once on the capacitor side on the positive side of the capacitor to initiate the resonance okay here we go We are all done. The oscilloscope has, has stopped the reading. Let me take you to the oscilloscope. Now this is my hand oscilloscope from which we are measuring the signal. Okay. So, let's see how well is the resonance this time. I'm just changing the time base for a moment. I don't know what the fuzz is all about over here. But you can see there is a very sharp peak over here. Now let's just zoom in. Yeah, there you go. You see how beautiful does it look like? You can also measure the frequency and thus calculate the value of the inductor. The value of my capacitor to be precise is about 400, uh, 548 my nanofour arcs. So I'm just going to tell you the frequency. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay. So, no. I think we measure the frequency till there. Yeah, there you go. So, the frequency is around 371 kilohertz. So, you people can just calculate the value of the inductor that I have used yourself because I don't want to calculate the inductance right now but as far as my calculations go the previous calculation go the inductor is of 0 0.37 micro henry and this is the inductor that we are talking about I hope you can see it and this is the capacitor this is just the bypass capacitor so that we get a clean signal uh, this is nothing nothing to do with the uh, oscillations this is the inductor that I'm that I had used and this is the capacitor okay so and we struck it with a 10 volt signal just a second yeah there we go with the 10 volt supply okay